Which one of these decks are you drawn to the most? And whichever one you're drawn to, this reading is for you. If you are drawn to this deck, this is your reading. If you are drawn to this one, your reading will be posted next, so go to my page. Okay, let's see what's coming through for you. Okay, that was quick. Let's see what this is. The Heart Chakra in reverse. Okay, so I have a feeling this is going to be a love reading. Or it may be matters of the heart that are weighing most heavily on your mind right now. We've had two fly out for you. Power, I was going to say, which is quite unusual for me because I don't have as many jump out usually. So it feels like that you like to take control of things. And so, yeah, there's something about not wanting to give your power away. But I'm also getting this sense of like closing your heart and trying to remain strong because of how you've been hurt. And the number eight is really standing out to me here because we've got eight and then four in reverse, which is either usually half or double. So yeah, I do feel like there's something to do with the number eight here that's resonating, maybe a birth date or a date in which something transpired which affected your heart. But we have the truth card here, the number 20, but I also feel really drawn to this one. Hope. Okay, this is a powerful reading here because three of these cards are the major arcanas, which means there's a lot of karmic activity happening in your love life and I feel like in your life in general because there are things that are happening that are outside of your control, which is really testing you right now. But as cliche as it sounds, it really feels like the truth is going to set you free. And this may even be that having hope or faith has been thrown into question for you recently with how things have been going in relationship to love and romance. But it does feel like there is this ray of hope. You may be feeling like all is lost right now, but I do feel something's going to be revealed where you suddenly feel, yes, you know what, there is hope. Even if it's tiny, it's there. And I feel like it's that hope that is going to give you that momentum to keep going. And one final tarot card here for you. The Two of Wands. I feel like this is about timing and waiting for the right timing before making a decision. Because I do feel like either you're confused about two options or you soon will be. But you're being guided to wait for this moment of clarity or this awakening first before you go ahead. 